Karen Cow, known for its air assets and special forces. But there's also an unusual combo of nations and services whose singular focus is to train Afghan national police recruits, but especially with Afghan instructors taking the lead. When I was at school, I, it was my hope to be a part of the government or be in the military and now I'm in the military, I work for my government and I love this job. He and the other police instructors are closely assisted by these reserve marines who act as subject matter experts on various subjects like marksmanship training. My favorite part about what I do is seeing the positive change in these Afghan soldiers because I know I'm, I'm giving them skills so that when they're out outside the wire and on patrols, I'm potentially saving their lives. A life-saving effort that's also supported by the Air Force, Army, and the Australian equivalent to the FBI. Something Hayumi loves and appreciates about his work. I'm doing my job, I love my job, my country. I want to serve and I thank the all Americans and all, all, also not the forces that help us. He realizes it will be solely up to them in the near future. They have come here for security and also for peace. And I'm really happy with that. And uh, we have to notice this, this point that one day they, they will leave this country and they will go back to their homes. And we have to make it by ourselves. Taking these recruits beyond being proud of their shot group to pride in serving their country. Marine Sergeant Andrew Milner, forward operating base Terran Kaup, Afghanistan.